Hey everybody, Steve here at Black Star HQ in Northampton, England, and I'm very, very, very excited this evening to welcome you to this webcast and to show you and talk about the new range of amplifiers from Black Star called the Artist Series. Now we have an Artist 15, which is here, and an Artist 30, which is here. Um, the Artist 15, of course, is 15 watts. And it's a 1 by 12 combo. The Artist 30 is 30 watts and it's a 2 by 12 combo. This is a really momentous occasion for us um, as for the past two to three years we've been concentrating on the digital products. So um, to get a Valve product again is very, very, very cool for us. Um, and I'm really, really excited to show you about it and take them around to show people in stores. Um, now Blackstar rose to fame um, with the artisan range of amplifiers many years ago, um, which were a hand-wired boutique style amplifier, really um, a good pedal platform and a very, very popular amp around the world for tone connoisseurs, if you like. And since then, um, there have been many, many products in the range of Blackstar, and the majority of those concentrate on multi-channels, clean and specific crunch and overdrives. Whereas really the artisan range um, just concentrates on a, a, a single platform, if you like, for pedals. Now, the design team behind Artisan have um, put a lot of work, a lot of hard work into this new range of amplifiers. And they've carefully distilled that heritage into the artist range. So we've got a very, very um, pretty looking product <clears throat> that has that classic vibe about it uh, with a modern twist if you like for flexibility so we have things like um, Black Star's ISF feature which won't be on the artisan range and the hand wide range um, which again allows you to really pinpoint your tone stack um, there's two channels on here both of them clean um, but the second channel when you push it hard will be a classic overdrive um, so again, reiterating a perfect platform for pedals. Again, the more modern uh, features include effects loop, channel switching. So we have that old school vibe with a new twist, which is really, really very cool. Um, important things to know, um, added features like the metallic fret. So uh, when, the, when the stage lights hit these, um, they look very, very cool, um, as you can hopefully see on screen now. Um, we've got a beautiful leather embossed Black Star strap here. Um, and also we're using Celestian V-type speakers. Uh, in the preamp stage, we've got ECC-83s and then a couple of 6L6s in the power amp stage. So a 6L6 is renowned for giving you a lot of headroom, a very, very good for clean and very good to handle anything that goes in front of it. These products love stomp boxes. Um, at the moment, I'm going through channel one on the Artist 30, and I've got one of our Black Star LT drive pedals going through. Um, so I'll switch between, um, so you can hear a stomp box, a classic drive going through the front end uh, of the clean channel on here. <laughs> Before I carry on, actually, it's worth men re mentioning to you that I do have a series and parallel switch here. So I'll be switching between the single coil settings and humbucker settings. So that will hopefully appeal to most of you guitar players out there, but we'll start on the humbucker. <laughs>
So as guitar players, we always generally um, look into the past at classic amplifiers from the 60s, from the British side of things, and also from the American side of things. Uh, we really feel that those characteristics and, and that vibe is within the artist range, so it's perfect um, for, the, for the fans of, of that kind of tone. Um, also, it's worth mentioning to you this this is a uh, the timber that's used here is, is is a birch ply cabinet so it's very very good quality but also lightweight so um it won't be too strenuous to take to the show so let's look back at the amplifier here um on channel one which i was just using with the stomp box um we've simply just got a volume and a tone control onto channel two now which is still fairly clean unless you really drive it quite hard and it becomes a classic overdrive. But now we have EQ, bass, middle, treble, and also Black Star's patent ISF feature, uh, the infinite shape feature which allows you to pinpoint uh, a point uh, in the EQ tone stack where you'd like it to sound for your ears, the sound in your head. You know, you can find it in here. Um, the palette of clean tones on here is, is just wonderful. We've then got a master volume and also a reverb built in. The reverb circuit is digital, um, but it's a very, very nice sound. Um, so let's look at the clean side of channel two and then I'll push it a little harder. <laughs> Let's go for humbucker. The ISF, incidentally, is over on the British side there, around about um, four o'clock. Now pushing the gain stage on the humbucker. Beautiful. A really traditional sound for an amplifier. Um, let's turn the ISF to the US side and revert back to single coil. And what I want you to try and notice as well is if I'm using any volume control and listen to how beautiful it cleans up.
great, great sound. Let's stick the stomp box through channel two now, just to see uh, how well it handles that, even if the amp channel is driving harder. So we'll start off again with the natural sound of the amp, and I'll make it pretty obvious when I click on the pedal for you. Just a superb tone, and you can do anything with that, you know? Um, we've got an LT drive pedal going through there now from Blackstar, but if you put a boost through there, a wah, if you're using modulation, uh, delays, reverbs, you can put them through the loop, which typically wouldn't be on a boutique amplifier of this type. Um, for example, the, the hand-wired artisan range, it's just straight plug in, away you go. But the fact that it's got all those modern features on here is really, really very cool. Let's take a quick listen to the Artist 15 as well. Okay, so now we're on to the Artist 15, um, which is a really, really great option for somebody who's looking for a single combo, one by 12. Um, one thing I didn't really mention before actually is the fact that we have a master volume as well as the channel volume which is very very cool so at the moment on here I have my channel 1 which is the first step of clean if you like um, the volumes up full here uh, and the master set accordingly so at the moment I'm on around about 12 o'clock on the master so it's a clean but it's a pushing clean so on a single coil, we've got this. Humbucker. Touch a reverb on there with the pedal, LT drive.
Beautiful sound, man. Beautiful. Um, on to the second channel now. Uh, again, we have our gain and volume, EQ, ISF. Um, let's see how this is rocking. The gain's up pretty much all the way here. <laughs> want to scream it sounds really really good um, let's maybe uh, try more reverbs just so you can see the lengths of what you can go to with that so we'll start we'll go on we'll stay on channel 2 back off the gain a little bit and we'll start with the reverb off so you can hear it dry because throughout this little demonstration on the webcast I've had a touch of reverb on just for ambience um, this is dry <laughs> So it's, it's not an over-exaggerated reverb or anything like that, it's just really, really useful. Um, super excited about these coming out and hitting stores, seeing them on stages, using them myself, really can't wait. So I hope you've enjoyed this webcast, this small introduction to the amplifiers. Um, if you're watching later on YouTube, hi there, thanks for tuning in and watching this uh, little session on the artist range. We hope you like them, we absolutely love them. Make sure you follow us on all the social media feeds, YouTube of course, Facebook, Instagram, and of course you can get us at inquiries at blackstaramps.com. I've been Steve Marks here in Northampton, UK. Peace, keep it loud. Introducing the Black Star Artist, a new classic. <laughs>